so we're going to talk about how to calculate the size of the press based on the part and the way we do this so as the material comes flowing into the part you can see it filling out and it goes down these rungs here it takes a lot of pressure to push that so this this is referred to as tonnage and the tonnage clamps the mold closed at the parting line and if it's not closed then it splits it and it flashes and it creates like this thin blade of plastic that comes out so you always want to make sure you've got enough tonnage for the part you're molding and the material you're molding so here's how we calculate that so we're going to go into the to the part here whoops um, he, here's here's the mold and our our plastic is coming in through here it's shooting down it's going up and around over all these things all the way out to the end and and then it's going to vent out here and we have to hold this closed so this side we need to push this down and this one we need to push that way and so what we're going to do is we're, we're going to go back into this part here. Um, and we're going to get, we're going to go into design. And what we want to do is we want to project the parting line. So all the surface that's within this boundary, this is considered the parting line right around the edge of the part here is the parting line. So we have to calculate that. So I created a sketch and I made a new body. So I, I created a body that looks like that. And now I can, now I can pick and I can measure the surface area. So I'm going to go and I'm going to go measure and it gives me 41.08 inches squared. So this material that we're molding this part out of this, this guy, it has to be really strong. So we're using a really strong material called nylon 6.6. And the nylon um, is one of the strongest materials in the plastic family. And it requires more clamping force than an easier to mold material like polypropylene. So if we're molding this and we go back in and we, we click on that, that part that I, I made and we go inspect, and we do this in inches, so we get 41.08, let's just say 41 square inches. Then what we do is we, um, we pull up our calculator and we take um, 41 times, and for nylon, it's like three to four tons per square inch. So I'm gonna say 3.5, I'm gonna split it right down the middle, I'm gonna say equals. And that's 143.5 tons, 143.5 tons of clamping force to hold this shut. So that's how we calculate the tonnage. It's, it's, it's all about the surface area at the parting line, everything within the boundaries of, of the part when the, when the mold breaks apart to hold it closed. So hopefully that makes sense. And, um, and you can figure out how to, to create that. So I just created another sketch and made a body, and that's that's how we did this part. So, so that's a, a fairly large press, and um, so we're gonna size our press right around 150 tons, and um, we'll we'll deal with that another time. Okay, so there you go. That's how you size the press to the to the part.